Now to two rounds to Riddick Bow in his last fight, went down in one. I think yes to both. He is taking the trip down memory lane, but he also, in this division, has not grown like some of the other divisions in boxing. He is also competitive with anybody in the top ten fighters lack, and that is ring savvy. Good combination from Larry Holmes. Well, if, if you were in the top. Knock that jab down. See how Larry controls with that left? He puts it out there and sometimes just leaves it there. Mind you, you're not eligible to fight for the championship of the world unless you're in the top ten. Anybody in the top ten can be selected by the champion to fight for that. Oh, Whoa. big right hand by Ferguson and Holmes is rocked. He's about ready to go. Ferguson turning it on. Holmes has to reach back save himself. He holds on. Gets in this fight. Big combination. The right hand and the left hook. Almost put Larry Holmes down to the canvas. Williams, he says, his toughest fight. So that Williams was smart. I had to slow him down. He had me down in the third and again in the fifth. Ferguson coming on. He really feels it. He has Holmes on the run. Pass to Ferguson. He laid down. Mercer later acquitted. And we will pause now for a word from your local cable system. In the past, just catching punches like that. Garing Lane, the last victim of Larry Holmes. Oh, and there's a left by Ferguson. Ferguson was not even ranked in the top ten. Gets a world championship fight. That's the and thing about the heavyweight division, though. He's never out of the picture. Every one of them. But right now, Ferguson looking to become only the fifth. Larry Holmes 12 and 1 in this comeback that has spanned three years. Yeah, he's terrific, but when he sets his opponent up, his knockouts come late in the fight, not early. Good combination from Larry. On the end is Ferguson. Again, right on the end. Oh, big right back. hand by Ferguson. The jab. And Ferguson's confidence level has to be way up high after shaking Holmes. Holmes doing a job surviving the second round. He was wobbled a minute ten into the second. Yeah, I think they're both trying to mess up my blackboard. So the tape coming loose. And the right glove of Holmes. They're messing up all of it. And Good and luck, Holmes. Getting behind Holmes. But never really won over the fans in such a vocal fashion. And he kind of liked to hear that. And enjoying this uh, comeback at the coming into the ring with sparring partner Sundrum who just kind of lays in there, doesn't really take the fight to his opponent. But that's not the Jesse Ferguson we're seeing tonight. Now, Start looking elsewhere. If you win it though, you pay your dues now. Yes, he did get caught in the second round. And that's uh, something that uh, Holmes uh, talked about earlier that we have been talking about now for uh, for weeks. These people fought everyone. I mean, you look at the champions. Lewis and his two defenses have, has caught Frank Bruno Foreman, who is uh, coming off a loss, and that was uh, over a year ago. Not ranked in the top ten. And 91st round of Larry Holmes' career, and he comes out got his attention in the first minute of the second round. And Ferguson has really pressed the issue and made raise by uh, Ferguson. And for Jesse Ferguson, who comes off the first round knockout at the hands of Frank Bruno, he is certainly out there. But frankly, he looks too good and the was Holmes with the right. Rocked back by Ferguson. Is, uh... Around his, his opponent's neck inside, and then he pushes out with it. So he steers with that left hand and then tries to load up on the right hand. Larry Holmes, Holmes, Holmes talking to Ferguson that kind of just generates conversation in the ring. No, Final seconds of the fight. He's a friendly guy, except when you're fighting. <laughs> oh, good left hook by both fighters. And that is it, the warm embrace. After 10 rounds, each fighter thinks that he won it. The Eastern Assassin, Larry Holmes. And 
the crowd that was chanting Larry, Larry, predominantly booing the decision and playing to the crowd. He won him over, Jesse Ferguson.